You know what? Oh. Hey, Cameron. What are you doing here? Wait, what are you doing here? What? Your eyes. Look. I'm sorry, it's the middle of the night. But I need your help, please. Come with me. I don't really have much time to explain here. I'll tell you what's going on on the road, I promise. Okay. Where are we heading? Halfway between Windhelm and Winterhold. Okay. Let me wake up a bit and I'll get my things. Of course. All right, I think I'm ready. Good. I'll meet you outside. Well, hello. Excuse need me. Need something? Nope. You weren't kidding. It really is the middle of the night. Yeah. Sorry about that. Hey, I understand. Uh, can I ask? About what? Um... Your eyes. Oh. Yeah, don't worry about it. Alright. Uh, do I have any... No, of course I don't. What are you looking for? Torches. I can't see in this. Oh, crap. I should have known. That's alright. Yeah, the, um... My eyes are a little spell. A little spell? Yeah. Keeps me looking mortal, at least for a little while. Well, that's good. I guess, for being in cities and all- Hush! Okay. Oh. You alright? Yeah, I thought I saw a dragon. I didn't know. I don't know what I saw. Probably birds. Oh. <gasps> so, what do you need me for in the middle of the night? And is it okay if I call you Ingrath out here? I would prefer if you didn't. He won't hurt you. You best keep an eye peeled. I will. Sorry. You did sort of wake me up in the middle of the night. My apologies. What were you going to say? Um... I forgot. Okay, uh, halfway between Dawnstar, not Dawnstar, Windhelm and Winterhold? Oh, oh boy. That's gonna be fun. Um, should I have just taken the path through the mountains? Don't worry about it. We'll get there when we get there. And I remembered what you were going to ask me. You, you did? Yes, and to answer your question, I need a healer. 
You need a healer, but my spells don't work on you. It's not for me. Oh. Uh-oh. Pardon me? This Us? is none of your concern, citizen. Yeah, I know. <laughs> um... You alright? I quite enjoy giving soldiers an earful. Okay. Ah, it's cold out here. Eh, I don't really feel it anymore. Oh yeah. I told you to keep your ears peeled. Yeah. Sorry. Okay. I know there's a path through here somewhere. Apparently I'm staring at it and not realizing it. You do seem to have a habit of prophecy. Well, thanks. How would you know? You don't know me that well. We had an entire conversation about how you came out looking for me. Or at least for the place I ended up, because you were having visions. That counts, doesn't it? I suppose you're right. Okay. If there's someone who's needing healing, we should probably... Hustle, huh? Out of breath already. <laughs> I'm not used to this. <laughs> I suppose you wouldn't be, huh? Nope. Hi, ah, Fox. I see I'm not the only one with a habit of greeting the wildlife. <laughs> you do that too? Yeah, when it's not detrimental to my health. <laughs> oh, good. What is it? Do you see the spider over there? I hear a spider. Why? This is gonna sound really weird, but I can see a glowing spider. I'm gonna take care of it real fast. Is someone there? There you <sighs> Oh boy. That was pathetic. Yeah, little sloppy, I know. But that's the glowing one. It's not glowing to me. That doesn't surprise me terribly. Ah, oh, okay. We might as well stay on the road now. Probably faster that way. Good point. And less likelihood of getting Attacked by wayward spiders, I suppose. <sighs> so what happened, if you don't mind my asking? What do you mean? I have a feeling I know, but who got hurt? A friend of mine. Interesting. Not a vampire, I assume. No, and I would prefer if you keep your voice down about that. My mask hasn't worn off yet, and I would rather... 
Uh oh. Excuse me. I would rather keep people in the dark about that, if at all possible. Okay, I can do that. So, a friend of yours. Yes. Wouldn't happen to be a Khajiit, would she? How did you know? Did you have another vision? It's something like that. I'll probably explain when we get there. I assume it's the same Khajiit I saw. Hey, uh, Kinoa. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Nothing. It's just amusing to see you eating, knowing what you are. What were you gonna ask? I was actually going to tell you. There's someone there waiting with. with the girl. She's like me. I just don't want you to be alarmed, is all. Alright. Not being alarmed, aye aye, Captain. Oh, we should probably hurry, huh? It's foggy enough, I'll probably be alright. Okay. I'm gonna hurry anyway, because I don't need you, like, burning up in the sun or something. I have potions. And again, if you could keep it down... Oh. Right. Sorry. It's no trouble. Okay. I think we're getting near Windhelm at this point. Yeah. When the road forks, take the left one. Alright, we'll do. This is this the one? Am I Nope, not quite. Trust me, you'll know it when you see it. Okay. Are you sure you're alright? It's getting kind of bright out. My skin is fine. My eyes might need a second. Oh gosh. Hold on. Hey, friend. It's good to see another merry soul enjoying this fine day. Haha. Uh -huh. Ah, but you look tired. Come, share a bottle of hunting brew mead with me. Ah, uh, sure, why not? Ah, nothing like fine spirits to help raise your... Well, your spirits. Cheers, my friend. May your adventures find you fame and fortune. Yeah, keep warm out there. Do you drink? Occasionally. Here. Hmm? Absolutely. All right, then. Do you not drink? I... Ah, uh, glowing goat. What? This goat is glowing. I'm gonna, you know, do my thing. Hair goats so fast. <sighs> well, I don't think that one's gonna happen. Just so you know, it's kind of hilarious watching you run after goats. <laughs> Suppose it would be. 
I was saying something before I got interrupted by revelers and I can't remember what it was. Oh, don't worry, we were just talking about my eyes. Oh yeah. I'm still headed in the right direction, okay. There's a fort here! Well, we've already come this far. I think we can go around this one. I hope so. Oh hey, he's not glowing anymore. You are a very strange woman, Kinoa. I'm aware of that. I've always been strange. Ah! Okay, we're just gonna leave him alone. Oh. I don't want any part of that fight. This is Stormcloak territory, they can have it. Interesting. Ah, uh, uh oh. Ah, uh, are you alright? For the moment, we should probably hustle. As you say. Yeah, it's still cloudy enough. I wish I could. Wait, can I? Ah, uh, I don't think I have anything that could help there. What were you thinking about? I was thinking I could try to summon a storm with my voice, but I don't think I can do that. All right. You dragonborn. Yes, I am. Okay, we've still got a fog bank, kind of. Yeah, that should help a little bit. Are we nearby enough? Should we duck in there for a while? Nah, it's nearby. Don't worry about it. Okay. You were going to ask me something. I was? Yeah. You kind of trailed off. Oh, right, before the fort. I was gonna ask you... Um... Is it about the eye or the voice? Um... Well, I was curious about both, actually, but I don't want to be rude. Stand down, silly dog. Alright. Just off the road here. Really? Yep. This might take some wanderings till we find it, but... They should be around here somewhere. Yep. Inside that barrow there. Okay. Wait. Before we go in, the eye I lost to an Argonian. And the voice I lost to a fire. That's all I really want to tell you right now. Maybe I can find a way to trust you in the future, but... That's okay. That kind of explains the scars, too. Yeah. Alright, now let's get inside before I burn to a crisp. Yeah, of course. Sorry. You're back. Oh! Hello. Uh, hi. I'm Kinoa. I was told you need a healer. Yes. Cayman, my dear, you should have warned me. I would have powdered my nose. What? She knows, Gold. It's fine. Now if we could please stop standing around and- Yeah, sorry. I'm on it. There. I might not be as good as a dedicated restorationist, but I've neutralized as much of the poison as I could. Interesting. How did you know it was poison? Oh, 
I... Uh, um, well, Cayman and I have met. I don't know if he told you. I don't even know who you are, but I'm his... Confidant. I think that's the most polite way to put it. We have history. <laughs> that's putting it mildly. So, you don't have to worry. If he trusts you, I trust you. Okay. Well, Cayman, you remember how I said I was a little weird? I had a vision of her. Getting stabbed or shot. I felt the poison. That's how I knew. A seer. Unusual. No shouts involved? No. Wait. How did you... You smell like dragon, Kinoa. It's pretty easy for one of us to figure it out. Cayman, do you always have to spoil my fun? Sorry. Are you two... an item? No, of course not. Well, I think my job here is done. I'll be heading back home if you need me. Oh, and before I forget... The Lord of Volkahar is getting impatient, Cayman. I'd suggest you put your other duties on hold and find out if that mage can help us or not. You didn't hear that. Actually, I didn't. It was all just noise to me. Good. I hope you don't mind if I stay here a while. I want to make sure she makes a full recovery and I'm not all that confident in my healing just yet. You're doing fine so far. Thanks. Funny enough, this is the second time I've saved her life. Really? Yeah, the first time was in Falkreath. She and Inigo ran into some werewolves. Inigo was pretty badly bloodied when I got there, but she was... Well, worse than this. I owe you thrice over, then. Uh, don't mention it. It's what I do. I need to go. Just for a bit. I'll look after her. Be safe. You too. You look a little less pale. Thanks. I should have asked if you needed anything. No. Just sleep, I think. <laughs> Damn good thing I am what I am, then. We can take watches. Alright. You're up, then. Hey, Ingrath. I noticed you called me by name instead of by Ismir back in Dawnstar. I did tell you that I would. Good point. I, uh... Actually, I wanted to ask you something. About a vision I had. It's been eating at me a little. Oh? Yeah. I saw... You, but... It wasn't you, it was... You saw that? Yeah. And Zaytest, obviously. Actually, I didn't recognize her until I walked in. I went into a state called the Dream Stride, and apparently all of Aetherius decided to dump on me at once. It was a bit overwhelming, to say the least. You're a powerful person. Any vision since then? Strangely, no. I wanted to know what that was. You didn't seem like yourself. That was something all of Osmer can do, even if they don't want to admit it. Most of them repress it so hard they need a ritual to bring it out again. But not you. <laughs> My mother always said I come from a long line of shapeshifters. Her namesake, Hecura, could sprout wings and grow spines like a dragon, supposedly. That's a bit hard to believe, but I did see you grow a mask out of nowhere. I try not to do it too much. You're right, I do tend to lose myself in that state. I uh, thought I killed her when I came out of it. How do you do that? I don't know. I've never really been able to control it. I get angry or scared and it just happens. It's like how I imagine werewolves must feel. Like... 
like I'm possessed by her scene himself. When I became a vampire, it just made me that much more dangerous. I'm sure that sounds especially mad. I don't blame you for being scared of it. I've... I've always been scared of myself. Your voice? No, actually, I didn't know I could do that until recently, but... I've always been able to do things without knowing how I know how to do them, if that makes sense. I was good at fighting from a young age. I was good at seeing patterns. I've... I've always been a little different. Most cunning folk usually are. I've never heard that phrase before. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Well... Lately, I've been even more scared than usual. I keep having visions. Seeing things. Like what? That's just it. I don't know. It... It feels like I'm remembering things I've already done, but... None of them are me. I... I don't really know how to explain it. Trust it. What? Trust your visions. Something my mother always told me. It may seem strange to everyone else, but if the gods are guiding you, they're doing it for a reason. Just make sure you keep your feet on the ground, too. Your mother seems like a very wise woman. She was. Kinoa, you're the only other person I've ever met, outside of my own family, obviously, that knows what it's like to have this kind of shit thrown at you. Do you have visions, too? I have... dreams. I suppose I journey out on occasion, but only when they need me to. Mainly, I just listen. Or try to, anyway. I... didn't expect that. I thought I was... sick. Or wrong, or something. Nah. You and I are just on a different path from most people. You especially. It's not an easy path to walk, as frustrating as all oblivion, but the world needs people like us. Like you. That might be the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me. Don't read into it. <laughs> I appreciate you telling me that. I Sometimes I don't realize what people mean behind their words, if that makes sense. Doesn't bother me. Frankly, your honesty is refreshing. <sighs> I'm never going to be able to look at vampires the same way. <laughs> vampires are like spiders. The stupid ones get killed. The smart ones? You never see those. <laughs> Which one are you? Stupid. But very lucky. Does she know about you? No. I've tried to keep my condition a secret for as long as possible. I... I don't think that's going to be possible anymore. She needs to know. Yeah. I had hoped to avoid getting her into situations like this. How old is she? I don't know. Younger than you, but not by much, I think. Well, then she should be able to make her own decisions. She can't do that if she doesn't have crucial information, like her guardian being a vampire, for example. She's not my kid. She might as well be. Who told you that? Sorry, I... Nobody did. I shouldn't know that. Oh. Yeah. I... I didn't see much in the dream stride, but I felt a lot. You love her. Ismir. She loves you too, Ingrath. She looks up to you. Kinoa, please. You know she never knew her father, right? Yes. Liar. Look, I don't know what you think you saw in my head but I want you to forget about it. If I could, I would. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about... everything. Everything. I... 
I don't know what happened in detail, but you... Kinawa, please. Please, for the love of Talos, just forget about it. My past is behind me. Is it? Gods, you're worse than Dominique. I think she'll be okay. Her fever is broken, at least. I'll leave now. Sorry. It's... It's fine. No, it isn't, but... That's my fault. I spoke without thinking, and I'm sorry. You're a dangerous woman, Kinoa. I know. I've been worse, I think. If you need me, I'll be on my way to Windhelm, and then to Solitude. I need to finish this thing, or it's gonna eat me alive. Kinoa? Yeah? What else did you feel? Love, I think. There was a lot of that going around. Oh. It wasn't just you and her that I saw. There was an old woman. She loves her children, her people. A mage. Oh, God. His was the worst. Worse than whatever was going on in my head. It, it was like someone ripped his heart out. Sorry, I'm getting confused now. I should go. I won't stop you. Good luck, Kinoa. You too, Cayman. And thank you. For what? Listening. <laughs> <laughs>